When you're in Tinkercad and you're going to make an animated GIF from the homepage and you can get there once you sign in to Tinkercad with your Google account, don't click join now, use sign in, then select your school Google account. You can click on Tinkercad, the icon in rainbow to get to the dashboard or your, your homepage. From here, you're gonna click on code blocks and in code blocks, that's where you're gonna create your animated GIF. You can click on create new code block when you do that. You can click on the quick start guide or you can scroll down and my recommendation would be to kind of look in the starter design to get an idea for how the code blocks work. So I've already set one up, so I'm gonna go back by clicking on the Tinkercad icon, and I'm gonna click on one that I already put together to show you how to turn it into an animated GIF and how to upload it to Google Classroom. So this is one that I made. If you had created one and you wanna go back in, you click on the icon of it, and then you press Tinker this. So you're gonna use the code blocks over here and you could drag them into your workspace and you can play around with it and see what happens. So if I, um, if you, if I play the code that I created here, press the black triangle to play it and you can see that a cube shows up and it moves it and it adds a circle and it slides it on the screen. So it's pretty straightforward. So now let's say that I would like to um, turn this in. First thing you're gonna do is change the name. You select at the top, usually generate some random name. You're gonna title it your course name and um, your last name. Once you do that, you're going to click on, sh uh, you're not going to click on export because that would be if we were gonna print it, which we're not doing. You're gonna click on share, okay? And when you click on share, you click on the button that says animated GIF. And then what it does is it plays your code and it runs it from beginning to end. So if you create a really complicated one, it'll take a while. Then it'll say packaging as GIF. This may take a minute. Your file will download automatically when completed. And it does take a little bit of time. So you just kind of have to wait and wait and wait for it to happen. And when that happens, it'll show up. Your download is complete. You can see it has a file name um, of your tech ed, whatever room you're in. I just did tech ed 202. And then your last name as an example. So you can X out of that little window. And then you go back into Google Classroom and you're looking for the assignment that's called turn in your animated GIFs here. Okay. So you click on that. The directions are in the written portion if you need a refresher. I'm gonna click on view assignment. And I'm gonna click on add or create. Then I'm going to click on file. Don't click on drive, make sure you click on file. Then you're gonna click on upload and then browse. and then you can click on recent and it should show up here. Your Tech Ed 202 last name or Tech Ed whatever classroom you're in last name and it's a GIF file, G-I-F. Some people call it a GIF file. So you select that one. You can double click it or you can click it and then press open. It will upload into your assignment here and the last step is to click turn in. And it asks you, do you want to turn in your work? Yes, I want to turn in my work. And that's all there is to it.